I'm John Avery. I'm a past uh, board member of Men of Valor and current advisory board member. Been involved with uh, Men of Valor for about 15 plus years now. Uh, first uh, got involved after Carl and Ken Leary had spoken to our session at church and uh, one of the elders on Wednesday night after that Monday meeting just turned around to me as we were waiting for the Wednesday service to begin and said, John, have you ever thought about prison ministry? And uh, Holy Spirit, uh, I think, used that moment to catch me uh, without any of my defenses up and excuses ready for why uh, I didn't have time or uh, other reasons that I couldn't couldn't work with Men of Valor. And I said, uh, yes, I have. I'd, I'd actually thought about uh, prison ministry since I was a teenager and just never had the opportunity to to uh, get involved. At any rate, uh, got involved, met Carl. He screened me uh, as a mentor and uh, introduced me to a man named Vincent Johnson who was in uh, prison at the time at Bass Correctional Center. And uh, Vincent and I began meeting and uh, about oh, five years later, Vincent got out in 2005, has been out uh, and been doing great ever since and uh, actually uh, has just recently been able to buy a house which is a wonderful thing and um, that that relationship with Vincent has just been uh, one of the greatest blessings of my life it's uh, I can remember on my way over to the prison the first time thinking you know what have I gotten into what in the world do I have to share with this guy that could be meaningful to him because I knew we, we would have very different backgrounds and uh, different perspectives, but um, went ahead and uh, didn't chicken out. And uh, interestingly enough, although we were uh, we do have different backgrounds and uh, different perspectives, Vincent uh, grew up in a Christian home just like I did, and uh, he just got involved in some activities that led him down a path that landed him in prison and. Uh, Anyway, we had uh, had a good time visiting while he was in prison. We had a great time uh, just being a friend since he's been out. And uh, like I said earlier, he's been doing wonderfully. He's had the same job since uh, a week after he got out in 2005 and uh, increasingly worked his way up in terms of responsibility with the company. And uh, I don't know what else to say. Men of Valor is... Uh, has been a great blessing in my life, just the involvement with the ministry and the people I've come in contact with. For anybody who's uh, thinking about uh, getting involved as a mentor, uh, I'll just say again, uh, th there probably any, any normal person who's never done this uh, uh, is going to have mixed feelings, both uh, enthusiasm and, and interest in getting involved at the same time, uh, some doubts as to what they really have to offer and um, whether or not they would fit. And I can just uh, encourage you to, to do it. Get involved. Uh, you're not uh, being called through this ministry to go in and save a guy or uh, do anything other than just be a good Christian friend and just be there. Be somebody who shows up, visits him. You'll have an opportunity uh, at least once a week to go and visit a guy and you might be surprised to realize that he looks forward to your visit more than anybody else and that you are far and away the most regular uh, visitor that he has. So don't, uh, don't uh, give in to the doubts or uh, uh, concern that you may not have what uh, to offer what uh, these men need. You do, just be a friend and be there.